Tarot friends, this is Ultraviolet Morgan with a really nice, big, chunky unboxing. I got all these wonderful boxes, uh, bo la 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 la. cards from a seller on Facebook in Facebook group, and I'm glad I joined. <laughs> So I am going to do my best to tear in this with one hand. And if that doesn't work, then I'll have to, okay, see my bare feet. If that doesn't work, I'll have to set it down and break out the knife. As you can tell, I'm really excited. <laughs> excited to be getting into these new decks. I'm going deck crazy. I will not lie. I cannot tell a lie. I chopped out a cherry tree. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Deck one. Oh my goodness. It's like in bubble wrap. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Uh, it's, it's, uh, I wanted to, I wanted to do it all nice and sweet, but mm -mm, I can't. I can't. I gotta get it open. Okay. Oh. Tarot de la Nuit. Oh my gosh! It's so, oh, so pretty, so pretty. Oh. Looking at it for real is so, so, moi. I mean, it's just, it looks good on the camera, but it looks even better IRL. <laughs> okay, so, as I said, it's second hand. Oh, what a nice box. I don't know. I don't have a box like that. I'm, I'm just going to kind of peek at these. I'm not going to do a full unboxing, but come on. I mean, I got to look. Right? Alright, there's a book. These are, I'm guessing, I really didn't do a whole ton of research, but I'm guessing that knew it means night. Because these are on the darker side. Tarot de la Nuit. Little book. Looks pretty decent. I like the looks of it. Looks like it's got information and not just, you know, not just a couple keywords. Uh, it does appear to be in a couple of different languages. So maybe not all of the information, not every page will be super useful, but that's alright, that's alright, that's alright. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Who gets Alice vibes? I get Alice. Like, she's on a throne, but it looks at first like she's laying on the ground, like she's falling down the rabbit hole. <clears throat> this is just... <laughs> this is just a cover. I mean, just, just an art card. It's not even a card. Card. Okay, so these are second hand, clearly. Um, I'm pretty sure that they are. Um, but they are in order, or they seem to be. So there's the fool. Oh, it's luscious. It's luscious. It's so deep. The colors are deep and dark. It's, it's luscious. Oh. Oh my gosh. I do love me a female magician. Oh my. Yeah. Yum, 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 yum. Was it? Who is it? Is it, um... Simon that gets in trouble for calling card deck yummy or something foodish? This is yummy. This is all kinds of... Oh. Uh, okay. Jeez, I'm not going to do a full flip through. I'm not. I am not. I'm going to skip. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Three of Pentacles. Oh, my goodness. Oh, stop.
stunning. Oh my gosh. These are just incredible. Cabinets. Ooh! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow. Queen of Wands. Oh. Holy cow. Okay. So those are the back. They're nice. Good quality cards. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Those these cards are oh, these were not on my wish list. On my I have a a top twenty list of cards that um I supposedly want more than anything else, but not really. They're just basically twenty decks off the top of my head that I felt like I had heard about enough times and seen and like was pretty lusting for pretty badly um this was not even on my radar but I just it was for sale and I checked it you know looked it up to find out a little bit about it and just went for it and I wanted some darker decks I don't really have any and it's coming into fall and Halloween, so, you know, get with that darker vibe. Okay, deck two. I'm just going to uh, go crazy. I will do a, um, flip throughs and, and, uh, well, not an unboxing, but flip throughs and impressions on these. Each separately. This one is so. If I wasn't filming, I would open these up so preciously. Like, <laughs> I mean, it's just bubble wrap. But I'd be like pulling them all apart real nicely. I know I would. I know myself. So I. It looks like an ice cream sandwich. It's not ice cream sandwich deck. Let's. See. See, this is a yummy ice cream sandwich. Oh, look, no spoilers. Ha 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 ha. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, Royo Dark Deck. Royo, Royo, I don't know. No. Um, if you want to correct me, feel free. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Listen, tarot friends, my heart and soul <laughs> apparently is with a dark deck. Because, yeah. Mm. Alright, now let's tease into these a little and try. It's so hard because as soon as you start looking at them, you just you don't want to stop. You want to keep going. But I want to see all the decks I got here, so... The Royal Dark Tarot. I'm just going to move it. And we're going to... Alright. The Star Cover Girl. The Fool. Wow. Man. That is just stunning. I, I, I don't know if I've ever seen... I think I've seen a female fool. I love that the fool is female. Um... If I have, I don't think I've seen sort of a realistic one or one with, like, this... Well, how often do you see a fool that looks like such a powerful card? I mean, the fool is usually, you know, a little foolish. Oh, but I'm adoring this. Okay. That's... that's that That makes me happy. It gives me lots of feels. Okay. Oh, hi. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Yeah. This is our magician. Wow. Okay. I love the mask. I, I feel like I don't know if there's a mask in every one, but I recently did a um, meditation where I saw someone with a mask. And so, this is kind of having some meaning for me. This is the High Priestess, of course. It's the third card. What else would it be? 
Wow. I... I can't say off the bat that I get any crazy high priestess vibes. Um... Or at least not traditional high priestess vibes. But I mean, I, I can get a powerful spiritual, feminine spirituality kind of vibe. So I'm going to say that's good enough. Oh, holy cow. Hello, Empress. That is so freaking incredible. Ugh. I thought there were crows. Somewhere on here. I thought when I looked down at it that there were crows. But there are bugs all over this card. <laughs> I'm not a bug person. But there's something cool about it. Oh my goodness. Although, I mean, she could seriously, seriously be a high priestess. But... She's the empress, and we can I can see that too. La empress. He's a little um I was gonna say Odin. I don't think that's who I mean. Whoever the Thor Thorish, you know the movie Thor. Boy. Hierophant. How interesting. Oh my goodness. These are going to be so much fun to study. They're so different. The lovers. Whoa. Man. <laughs> it's a great Halloween deck. Wow. Creeptastic. I... I it, I love how it feels very confronting. It feels very confronting to me. I like that. Um, I don't. I, I want. I want at least one deck that's like that. The chariot. Whoa. Yeah. <sighs> oh, hi. Is this the two of cups? Holy moly! I don't know if this deck is safe for work, guys. I don't know. Oh. Wow. Six of Pentacles. Man. Yeah, this is... This is a special deck. Okay, I gotta get it through because I've got more decks. Okay, I got more decks. What's this one? Swords. Ace of Swords. Okay. Get a good focus. Oh, wow. Yeah. All right. That's it for the Royo Dark Tarot. Oh, that. Oh, my God. Oh my god, Becky. These are incredible. Okay. Man. Digging down deep. Oh, cool. Hi there. So, yeah, our last two are big ones. That's that big one. Uh, oh, you might, you probably saw what that is. Oh. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Yeah. This is becoming a serious addiction. <laughs> oh. Oh. I just got chills. I just got chills. Oh, my gosh. Okay. There you go. Wow. I, I, wow. 
I don't know. I I knew. I know that I like vampires. I knew that I would like this deck. But. Oh my god. I didn't know I was going to get chills, people. We're at 15. Oh my gosh. Phantasmagoria. Oh my gosh. Jeez. I really don't need to buy any more decks because these are so incredible, but you know I do. Of course I do. This is a crazy book. I think this is the deck that, um, I'm not sure, but I think this is the one that Owl, no, I can't think of her name. Owl Moon, the one that Owl Moon, um, is like her personal deck. Okay, this is one of those pain in the butt setups. But, I mean, alright. These cards are not in order. Oops, oh, sorry. Sorry, folks. So the first one we get to see is the Hanged Man. The first one we see is the Upside Down card. Wow. Yeah, this is... Ugh. Check that out. Ah. Oh my goodness. Dude, people, I don't even have words. I don't. I don't even have. <laughs> I don't even have words. Ugh. The fool. Oh, what's this? Who's this? Who are you? Six of skulls. Oh my gosh. <sighs> the fool. Francisco. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I'm like, I'm just, yeah. Wow. Really, seriously. Wow. I don't know. I know that I bought these four decks and I got a pretty decent deal because I bought four of them together and then I, you know. Um. But, you know, whatever I paid for this. It was worth it. This, oh my god. I gotta put this away. I don't even want to. Okay? I don't even want to film it. I just, I want to film it because I want to have it captured. But I like, oh my gosh. Like, feel like, yeah, I can see why she keeps that to herself because she feel like, I want to be left alone with this deck. Everybody just leave me alone. We need to be alone. We need alone time. And that book. I think, it, I think it might be a novel. I'm not sure. I mean, it looks pretty incredible. Okay. Okay. This one. I mean, I knew what these were, you know. But I just... Okay. Oh, that's right. The spellcasters. Oh, my goodness. Modern spellcasters. If this is... Man. Man. I'm going to go into tarot overload. From just awesome amazingness of tarot. Maybe next year or the year after or one of these years. After I'm done like hoarding up all the incredible decks. I'll do a depth year. And like just spend a whole year on ah, one or two of these. What a wonderful book. I know, it's just pictures are impressing me, but, yeah. This whole chunky book is in English. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, same type of box deal thing. That's kind of aggravating, but, what it is. Do I see the back of this? I don't know, the back of the vampires one just get me chills. Ooh, I love the, oh my gosh. I love the card backs. 
Those are fantastic. I don't know if these are in order. Nope. Oh my goodness. Wow. I don't know if you can see it, but these are metallic, like bronze. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, this is one I've seen. Oh. Man, these are no freaking joke. These are so good. Oh, these are so good. Okay, folks, we're at 20. Whoops. So, I'm about to wrap it up. Oh, this has got to be a knight of swords. Look at that. Jeez. Okay, so I have, like, the four best decks ever um, until I find the next four best decks ever here, but, I mean, wow, wow, oh, wow, can I say it again, wow, these are fantastic, look at, this is the Wheel of Fortune, okay, I hope you're all looking forward to full flip-throughs and commentary on each one of these incredible, incredible decks, and then maybe even, um, Reviews later once I've had a chance to check out the books and work with the cards. Um, I'll see you later. This is Ultraviolet Morgan. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. I live for comments because I want to have a conversation. So, until next time, this is Ultraviolet Morgan saying... Stay cool.